and hello everybody and welcome back to the stream or if it's your first time here welcome hope you're having a fantastic wednesday or whatever day it is for you right now and so yeah new week uh we're still on death and taxes for the main game though so today is going to be a more normal chill stream type night so i uh, hope you all been uh you know having a good time hope your weekend went well and that uh your week has started up uh, and uh, you know been good for you as well and yeah, we're just gonna get into World of Horror. Last time we played this two weeks ago, uh, we found these challenge challenge modes, and I suspect if I do some challenge mode and be able to win one or two of them, then like we'll unlock stuff, right? So we're gonna try and do those challenge modes. Uh, probably one with uh, the strength character because it's 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 just easier, easiest one of the ones that we're allowed to try. I think you're I think you get uh, the mission. You think you get the challenges if you win at least one time with the character we have like uh, we have like the the dexterity character the strength character and the med student unlocked so yeah we're gonna try and uh, do these challenges to see if uh we can uh, unlock anything off of them so yeah i uh, hope you all having a good time that you have a chill time around here so try and get into it but is my avatar working i think it is yeah i think he is all right cool uh, I might have to move him to the side. Move him to the side a little bit, because that's just... The only problem with the challenge modes is that we can't save over them. Am I, how much am I covering up? I think I, I think this is a good place for me to put the avatar. Might not be able to see the, the head. Or uh, the... Uh, one of the stats. There's stats in that corner of the screen. We'll see. I'm gonna randomize it. Close my eyes. Wow, that's menacing. Red, black. Okay. Jesus. Tub number one. As expected, tub number one. All right. This is the one where we're trying to. Uh, Quit smoking on Haru. Old God's rule? Oh no, bonus damage to everybody. That that's Oh, thank you so much, Tub. <laughs> Alright. Wada! You have Wada. And we have to go with uh, nicotine withdrawal the whole game. I should get the occult shot more often. Like, we need, like, candles and stuff. And preparation is useless in this challenge because Haru gets a cigarette thing. He gets, like, a cigarette thing, Bob. You can disable your friend, your neighbor. That's weird. All right. So we don't need to... Oh, we do have an empty bottle. Okay, so let's go bay it. Fill bottle. XP boot. Go to our closet. Get the money. Put on cool military jacket. Sure. Um, anything else? You have a lot of water. It's good because we're going to take a lot of damage. Complete at least one mystery to save progress? I thought we couldn't save during these. Be taking a hammer next door. I'm going to disable my neighbor. <laughs> yeah, it's weird that you can disable Kana. Just is. Very strange. All right, though. So, uh, get started. I think that's all the prep you can start with. We have seen all of these. I think Blood Curling Botanist, this last ending, is only on the, the B world. So, uh, sure, I have normal arms. This is the one where with the... The army man, like, stealing 
women's underwear. The pre preparation is useless. We're not going to do that. Investigate the hospital twice. Well, first, I want to buy five money. What? Illegal den is... For the occult shop. Ritual dagger. Is this a... Uh, that's a knowledge weapon. That's pretty cool. We're not a knowledge character, though. Wow, what the fuck? Drink an occult amulet. Less doom, but less reason. Mummified heart. Use defeat of vampire. <laughs> okay. Get the candle. Candle's good. Now let's go to hardware. Carpenter hand hammer. Wow, that hit rating is so bad. That's awful. I'll give it a try. I'll give it a shot though. Luck while in inventory, or used for a reason. Right, right. Okay. We have one money left, so we're not going to bother anymore with that. Let's uh. Hospital twice. Okay. I don't want to... Oh, man. Okay. I don't have good dexterity. Wait, I have six dexterity. Let's try to sneak. Yes! Alright, good. Investigate again. Don't ruin the calm moment. Plus one reason. Oh, that was useless. Minus one reason! The anatomical museum archive displays a specimen with elongated arms and jellyfied bones. That's, that's so cool. What the fuck? Okay. Ooh. Walking through the park. Oh, this, I don't remember if this is charisma or knowledge. Oh, let's take her home. Oh, it wasn't any of those. It was just 10 XP minus 2 stamina. Okay, that's fine. Experience points are valuable. Let's talk to Kana. Hey, I'm busy today. Let's hang out some other time. So we'll try next investigation. Fuck. Read the letters. Money! Luck check success. Sweet. It seems you've won a small amount of money in the lottery. Man, imagine winning two dollars. What does Nugget think about this? Nugget thinks that there are not enough nuggets. Go Nugget the Nuggets. Are there nuggets in spooky Japanese game? So more money is pretty good. Let's go here and see if there's anything. Compass or the camera? These are both pretty good. I have nothing in slot B. This is a slot... You know what? This is experience points, though. You know, I'm looking at this though. I just love the nug impression. <laughs> I mean, it's not it, it's not the, the most difficult thing to do. <laughs> um I, I I'm not gonna lie, I haven't used the camera before. I wonder if it might be useful. Let's try let's try it. Oh that was a that was a cool sound. Oh I just realized I can uh Drink one of these, and then put the bottle away. But I have more inventory room. The scene is disturbing. You struggle to look at it. Charisma success, five experience. We're getting a lot of experience. I like it. I think that's a good thing. Wait, the camera cost... Oh, wait, no, we had three. Never mind. Water the empty quarter, you find an old vending machine. Get the cheapest one. Dexterity success. You buy a can of off brand soda and take a sip. It tastes a little odd, but you enjoy the drink anyway. More experience. Wow, we're getting so much experience. Oh no, the booba. Their, their underwear has been stolen. Order things done. Labels printed. Very good. Excellent, excellent work. You're rustling on the other side of your apartment door. Someone's trying to get in. 
And oh man. Wow! 30% hit chance! Are you fucking serious? Oh my god. Why do I do this? I just need to punch these people, apparently. That is not nearly enough to justify... If I get him to like seven, we could uh, do a guaranteed carpenter hammer attack. Well, actually, wait a minute. This is five. Okay. We can hit him. We can try this one more time. Okay. This is five. Okay, so can we do this? No! You motherfucker! Son of a bitch. Okay, one more time then. Fuck! I hate that. Fucking die. My god. Baseball bat! Let's take a look at this motherfucker. Four damage. It has a high hit chance, though. Ooh. That's probably way better than this thing. This thing's hit chance is so bad, it's... I feel retarded getting this thing. We have some comments on more Japanese Animal Crossing vids, because it's a good way to learn vocab for words like peaceful, soothing, etc. I believe it. I feel like I'm not going to have the hardest time with, like, the grammar and the language. Just that filling your head with so much vocabulary is uh, an ordeal. It's a bit of an ordeal. Um, let's drink this. Put it away. I'll keep the carpentry hammer. I'm yapping so much in Japanese. Nothing wrong with that at all. It's great. Maybe I should throw this. I should keep this to throw it, I guess. Vocab okay, is the number one struggle for me just because it's literally memorizing massive amounts of words. Yeah, exactly. <laughs> I'll do charisma check, sure. Charisma success plus four reason? Wow. Well, now we have basically maximum reason. Game is uh, going really well so far. Share your experience. I don't remember what getting this does for you, though. Sure. Wow! Okay, it's, mo it's experience for money. Well, that was a lot. Check the vent. Tiny key! We can use a tiny key in some of the areas. So, that's pretty good. If I wasn't stupid, I would have leveled up from that, but it's too late. We gonna have to keep staff and hospital busy. Skipping line will cost you more. I don't give a shit. I go to the school nurse. I don't care. Okay, let's first... So, for the moment, we'll put this away. Specifically, so we can get the empty bottles. Take a bath. Bottle. Bo I have two bottles, though, motherfucker. Ugh. Uh, hot water. Oh, this fucking game. <laughs> I'm going to drink, and I'm going to put a bottle away. So I can throw the bottle. Huh. 
Well, that sucks. The only way I can learn it is to, is, it is to immerse it too, so it's like, how many can I fit into my head from a 20 minute Sims video? I think what my thought process is, is that once I know enough of the vocabulary, I'm gonna try and like think sentences in my inner monologue in the language. Because I've heard that that's a really good way to solidify it, is if you can start speaking both, like, more than... If you can speak the language, like, in your own inner monologue. That's probably one of the ways I'll do that. I'll try. Okay, uh... You know what? Let's just sell that. Take the key. I'm not good at writing, so I don't know if I would try writing as my methodology. But, uh... Right. Okay, let's take a look. Ew, it's the ran- Oh, it's the rancid ramen? Okay, yeah, we can do this one because we can discard the bottles. Which sounds- Which sounds stupid, but... Okay, we found the smelly meat. Hey, Kana. I visited it. Let's hang out some other time. All right. Oh, actually, wait. Can I click on this? This? I have a kanji dictionary I got from that manga store. So let me get, get a copy for you. And you. Oh, yeah, yeah. God damn, though. <laughs> Fuck it. I mean, like, one thing I noticed about, the con about kanji that's intriguing that might make it not as difficult as I think is that a lot of the kanji are just, like, a mash together of larger of other kanji. So, like, you can sort of, like, if you squint your eyes, you can kind of look inward and be like, oh, I, I recognize some of these symbols as after they've been squished together. Right? Who the fuck would turn off Kana unless they need criteria for some specific run? They're so cool and a homie. Why would you not want Kana? I have no fucking idea. It is very, it is a very weird prospect. Like, why would you not want like a free ally that doesn't get any doom when you go and recruit them? I know. Okay, I got funds. I have so much fucking money. What the fuck? Go to the illegal den. I have so much money that I'm just like, what the hell? Thrown items deal more damage. Bandage. Unironically, why not? Let's do it. Bandage. Let's temporarily put the key away again, and let's go here. Or do we go with cult shop? Yeah, no, let's go. Let's go here because we have a C a C slot to. Aha! Yes, compass. We like the compass. The book is just nice to have a physical copy of. The main thing I use is my conscious setting app on my phone. Does every word even <laughs> even slurs? Listen to the man. Minus five doom, minus three reason. Well, there's less doom, so that's good. I'm not gonna lie. Even though I have had a phone for like seven or so years now, like a like a, a smartphone. I'm still quite a boomer with it, and I just don't really have a massive number of apps on it. Okay. Oh, Kana's still busy. All right. Telephone sounds and mobile voices are too loud for you to ignore. When you went to the apartment, everything turns silent. Gossip Junkie. Reason Damage. Okay, so... Yay, the baseball bat is reliable. It deals more damage. One, two, three. Oh, wait, though. Wait, three... Oh, no. Oh, no, no, that's ten. That's ten. Okay, all right. This is, therefore, obje Oh, I can't dodge at the same time. You know what? 
I don't care that I can't dodge. Are you joking? I'm gonna be so angry. This misses. There we go. Nice. All right. Blah, blah. So I like quick thinking because it gives us dexterity. And dexterity is the strongest stat in this game. Well, the strongest combat stat in this game. But folklore studies and art knowledge let you... Give you more options during certain events. I think... Perception is also very valuable. Let's, let's get 8 perception. Let's get 8 perception and... Uh, nah, maybe not eight charisma. You know what? Um, get a dex yeah, let's get a dexterity. Sure. Uh, all right. So, okay. Damn it. I only have six knowledge, so research the occult notes is probably bad. Fuck it, I'll try it anyway. Knowledge check failure. <laughs> now I got that attack on Titan shadow above my eyes. I'm not gonna lie, I literally never remember which of these effects does what. Minus two funds, great. Okay. Guard two items, I already did that, yeah. I don't have money to buy a coffee. Jog around the block. Strength check failure. <laughs> I just trip and hit my face. <laughs> That's so stupid. Ooh! Okay, here's the problem. If I take it... Guns kind of suck in this game. If I'm going to be totally honest. Because when you use them, they, like, blow your eardrums out, and there's still a chance that you miss, and you don't even necessarily deal more damage than you could do with just beating it to death with your fists or a baseball bat. I do have eight perception... Let's do check wounds. Nice! Experience game. Investigate lab. File plus meat. Continue. Nice. Very good, very good. Crimson moon spotted over Shiokawa keeps everyone on the edge. Now, the only issue is that now I don't have a, uh, one minor injury. Okay. The only issue now is that I don't have my, uh, bottles. I can't use the bottles, but okay. Let's go here and get some reason regain. For 12 reason. Okay. Wait. Am I covering it? I am. Hold on a moment. I just realized... Okay. Come on, come on. Okay, you can just barely see my reason stat now. There we go. Okay. Got the rum. We got, we got a lot of them. Beckoning Bulletin. I like beating the shit out of the Beckoning Bulletin one. It's very funny. I'm gonna destroy this fucking fax machine. This modem. Hey, you nugget knows many slurs. Oh yes, he is he is sparing the world from his own power over racism. Not gonna lie, we have 23 Doom. Let's go hire some students. Ask join. Join. Uh nope. Okay. Minus one strength. Cheaper pharmacy items. Okay, we're gonna. 
let you go because you're just a, a, a debuff. Have some random woman following me. Confront the person. Luck check failure. Decomposing skin and vacant stare can only mean one thing. It's a corpse someone has propped up. The idea that someone could do it so close to you and so quietly makes you shudder. That's gross. That's 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 creepy. <laughs> Forest again. Ooh! Punch him! What the hell? You let out a rumbling yell, turning and driving your fist into empty air. There's nobody there. He's gone. Your wild swing sends you stumbling and confused. All this shit is really starting to get to you. But even if you ran to one of the real guys, they'd probably just hate your guts. They'd probably hate your guts just as much. Right. We have the forest known. So I remember how this... Put the forest note away. Uh, wow. Getting access to the student database would certainly be your investigation. I don't have, uh, Kazu I don't have, uh, Kazumi Nakawa. That's very specific. Talk to her. Oh, charisma check success. Unannounced inspection, she asks. Thanks you, thank you for telling me. While the receptionist is busy updating some boring papers, you copy some names and addresses from the database. We're getting really lucky. Not gonna lie. We're, we're actually getting really lucky. I have never known if Yakuza card is worth it. We don't have any money right now, so I don't think it really matters right now. Let's get a strength and a dexterity. Oh wait, all combat moves deal an extra point of damage. Yeah, that's okay. It's not strength, but it is. It is a uh, we have we have good stats eight in all these. We deal more damage now. That's good. We already did- yeah, we did the- yeah, yeah. Kuza card may not be worth it, but Yasai Kuza card is very worth it. <laughs> Stop right there! You won't destroy my life's work. Obsessed man. This is- what the fuck? 50% hit chance? 4, 8, 12. 80% hit chance. Launch. I beat him to death. I pounched him to death. I don't understand how hit rating works sometimes, but oh well. Also, hey Kana. Nope, they're busy. Okay. Get close to the door and ask what the matter is. Dexterity check failure. Oh yeah, with eight dexterity. Thanks, game. All right, resolve. Hot bath. Fuck. Hot bath is so inviting. You've spent an extra hour in it. One percent doom. Thanks. Okay. Minus two stamina. Right? Remember when I said I was getting lucky? Well... Uh, examine the package. Dexterity success. As soon as you pick up the package, you realize what you're holding and drop it in horror. Eight experience. Gouge's eyes. Indeed. Gouge his eyes. Absolutely. Minus two reason. As you walk through the village... Crops waver in the breeze, following your every movement. Oh, that's just Ohio. What do you mean? That's not... That shouldn't be a, a reason loss. Plus 4% doom. Wow. I think waking up to Kirby's belly was a good omen. I agree. My knowledge is very, very low. I'll try it anyway, because I'm a fucking moron. Knowledge check failure. 
Directed by a huge man wearing a demon mask, you have trouble following the intricate pattern of steps, paths, and claps. The ritual is a disaster. Oops. As long as it's not waking up in Kirby's belly. What if we all live in Kirby's belly? What if that's the truth of the universe? That this is all a pocket dimension inside Kirby. Best gate computer. Remember the note. Suffering is human. You refuse to die! Minus 5 stamina, plus 15 max stamina. Wow, minus 2 all? That's crazy. 6, 12, 18, 24, 30. Oh man. Why is it 46%? Whatever. Dodge. Let me go back here. Why is it 46%? Come the fuck on. Whoops, I didn't mean to do that. Uh. Oh, that's so fucking annoying, dude. Oh, It has 64 power. Wow. I think I'm gonna die. What's this? This is an 8 damage? Okay. If I can get this down to like 8, I can just uh, do one more guaranteed. Oh god, I'm gonna die. I am so fucking dead. Oh my god, I just barely survived. God damn! Could watch some JP Let's Plays of this game for Pokemon Revolution? Yeah, we should do that. That would be cool. I'm also curious to see what the Japanese think of this game since this was made in Poland. You should eat a superhero turn to clean shit up around here. <laughs> yeah. I'm going to level up off of this. Great, because I uh, almost died. Get a new level plus. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I don't know why it keeps doing that. Like, I know. I know how level up works. Surface level Googling? They seem to love it. Oh, that's awesome. Very cool. Uh, let's get a luck and a quick thinking. So now we can use dexterity items and it shouldn't be too difficult. We need a reason bath. I think I'm gonna like sell the baseball bat and then get a knife because <laughs> I have nine dexterity, you know, so. weird. Okay. We're gonna use the rest option a bunch right now. Horrible history of household hell. Man, I vaguely remember this. I vaguely remember these both. I still want to get sucked into something where I can't rest. Let's go here. Old mansion around this town. Oh, 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 Manor is one of them. Supposedly haunted by a family of four who disappeared without a trace once. I'm really, there's only one tragic event, but only, is it only... But is it the only tragic event that took place there? Investigate. Okay. All right. Yeah, we definitely need to uh, heal up. What does hard knock do? Yeah, I don't. I don't have a nicotine rush. I'm cold turkey.
bees in. Well, let's uh let's use the rest function a bunch. Okay, now we're above tens and everything. So I feel less uh fucked. Investigate seaside twice, let's do it. Plus two reason, plus four doom. Great, okay. No, I forgot, I forgot. Let's uh, go to the schoolyard. Ask to join you. Give me a break. Okay. That's fine. On the beach, you discover a giant charred pit. As you wonder what was burning here and why, you hear a crackling getting louder and as everything around you becomes scorching hot. This is one of the better tracks in this whole game. Oh god, it's a fucking... Oh no, it's a fucking ghost enemy. Oh my god. No, we're running away. We are running the fuck away. Holy shit. Architect's journal. Okay. Do I just sell this at this point? Do I have anything else? What else do I have in storage? Chiyokawa Herald. The Forest Note. Problem is that I'm pretty sure I'm not going to have enough money to get uh, the flashlight. I believe the flashlight is very, very good here. In this uh, particular mission uh, investigation. Run from the window. What do you mean, dexterity check failure? I have nine. Fucking Christ, game. Uh, the doggo shop is gone, I just noticed. While you walk through the crowd, face someone bumps into you and quickly apologizes. Realize what happened. Perception success. There's a game that he played that got taken down by copyright troll. And I know you don't remember the name of it, but I can't say it in case it gets struck, so I'm a... Say it later, and Rag found a Rama. Oh! I remember what you're talking about. I, I, I remember exactly what you're talking about. Yep. Yep, I remember exactly what you're talking about. Pulls you towards the beach. The statue at half buried in the sand is calling to you. Ignore it. Strength check failure? Suicidal? A sudden wave of dread paral paralyzes you as you stare at the menacing statuette. You manage to escape, but its gaze is forever burned into your brain. What the fuck? Chance of losing stamina each time you lose reason. What the fuck? It's cool that Rag found a ROM of it, though. It needs to be preserved. You know, the old 90s looking ass game. You know what I haven't done? I haven't asked uh, Kana again. Okay. I did, however, try to go back to the school, so. I hate you so much. Peace of mind. Uh-oh, now we're here. Now we're stuck in here. <gasps> you feel watched. Light the holy candle. You light up the holy candles, purifying the room. Minus three doom. Hell yes. Right. Rifle through the cupboard. No matter which of the choices you pick, you get I, you get this. You get the ghost jump scaring you. Locations threat level increase. Well, good thing I have good combat stats. On my abandonware, the copyright, the copyright N word even left 
comments berating them for having a ROM. The ROM is gone from that site now. Mike, what is wrong with the people with whoever is doing this? It's so fucking weird. I have good perception. Search the room. Ooh, I got a broken bottle. Okay. It is a dexterity we Why is it glowing like this? That's weird. Fast to equip. Speed 90, hit 70. It has less hit than this, but it is faster. Let's try the broken bottle since our dexterity is currently higher than our strength. I wonder why it's glowing. There aren't sure what to expect. The, study, the sturdy door to the study opens the creek. The dark, dusty room is empty, but something feels wrong. Faint draft, perhaps? You move the rotten carpet aside to reveal a secret passageway cut directly into the cliff rock. Make your way down. Following a strange song, you discover a hidden passage that leads you to an underground chamber connected to the sea. You can't find the source of the sounds, but then, but then it hits you. The acoustics of this place must be the waves. Make the waves sound like the most beautiful serenade. Mesmerize, you step closer to the stone altar at the end of the room. This is... So, we need, like, the flashlight to be of great effect here, but we don't have it, so we're going to explore some more. Yeah. Yeah. Step closer. I believe if we had different items, we would summon that giant squid monster. And if we had a gun, we could probably kill it, but... That, that requires so much setup that we just don't really have. CK, CQC training, Ire Zumi. Items in the shop are cheaper. Plus one luck. I'm going to go with Ire Zumi and Dexterity. Because Dexterity is overpowered. Air feels heavy, it's hard to breathe. Rest action is less effective. Shop option is disabled. Blood... Oh, this is why everything got so hard to hit. Oh, we got blood mooned. All of our non-basic lands are mountains now. Man, what a blowout. We got bodied. Okay, so... I feel like I'm just gonna... No, who knows when I'll need it. I might need it randomly at some point. You know what I haven't tried it? I haven't tried the flash option. I should try that. I should sell this or throw it. One of the two. Ooh. I'm gonna take a moment to just BRB and get uh, some Pepto-Bismol. Hold on a moment. It's not serious. I just, uh... Just bad enough that it's a little bit, uh, requires a little bit of my attention. Get to mute the microphone. Did you hear the jo all the creaking and stuff? <sighs> okay, let's do a reason bath. Nope. Oh, I guess I just didn't hit it the second time. Okay. Because this chair is loud, you know, when I move a lot inside of it. 
We only have one mystery left. And uh, we have a decent amount of leeway, right? Saving loading is disabled temporarily, even though before, earlier we could definitely use it. It's fine, though. I'm probably going to throw or sell this in a moment, though. Blood Curdling Botanist. I remember this one. This guy is actually an enemy. Like, we uh, we take we remove his, the top of his head and he has uh, the, the fungus in him. Okay. Investigate the school twice. First, let's talk to Kana. We'll be busy today. Let's hang out some other time. Okay. Damn it. Does Kana only ever come out, like, when during that mission or something? I don't know. I don't like the shop being unavailable. Let's go to this shop, though. First doll. Takes stamina, but deals a bunch of damage. Throwing items deal more damage. Oh, and it's a C slot. I have to actually have this in my C slot. Mm. Chance of ignoring reason loss. Ooh. Additional magic slot. I don't know if I care about any of this, actually. I don't have the Yakuza card. Well, that sucks. I bet she would do everything to be with you, even if it meant to cheat death itself. Stalker girl. Well, this is spooky. So let's uh, let's dodge. Seventy-five percent hit chance. 95% hit chance. Come on. Come the fuck on, game. Come on. Stop! Game! No more! Diary. Cool. Oh my god, okay. Uh, let's sell this thing. What is this? Cult Diary Doom. Use minus three Doom. Use immediately. Wow, this fucking sucks. Our uh, stats are unbelievably low. You use this for reason gain later. Wow, I get only one? That's crazy. That's fucking ridiculous, but okay. I thought we were doing well. And then suddenly we just take so much... Dexterity, success. The hooded woman disappears behind a corner. When you get there, she's gone. Already mixed in with the crown. In a nearby dumpster, you find the sulfur stinking hoodie and an envelope containing your photo plus curious incantation. This does a lot of damage, but it gives me doom and costs me stats. Forget this spell. Anybody here? We're always such a kidder. They ha okay, so it's it's money, health, reason. Cordyceps. Yep, the classic. Uh, what cordyceps ever could? Uh, I control people, and the answer is no. 
I'm gonna lose. I just took way too much damage from that... from the Stalker Girl fight. It's really annoying. I dodged... I have 10 dexterity. I dodged like three times and she hit me every time. I might die in this combat, like, if I just keep getting fucking hit. The game is unreasonable. Eighty percent. Now it's a hundred. Okay. Why? This game is so fucking annoying at times. Double. Yeah, it doesn't matter. That's such nonsense, dude. I got through so many just fine. And then suddenly at the very end, I just... They just... Repeatedly hit me, even though I have 10 dexterity. What fucking awful luck. That's awful luck. Okay, let's... Uh, I'm gonna close my eyes and randomize it. Ah uh, yes, it's uh it I was gonna say it's piss yellow, but it looks more green actually. My god. Game is brutal. Oh, we can't run from a ca combat now. That sucks. Oh well. Oh load. Yeah. I have two bottles. Go here. Fill the bottle. Experience bath. Turn the blinking off. Look out here. See weird shit. Go over here. Get this. Put on dirt. Sepia again? Oh. You know what I suppose? I suppose that, uh, that makes sense. Okay, well. Try again. Ooh, we've never done this one before. Nightmare news of the no noisy nails. Well, let's do one we know we can do first. Contagious coma is always fun. Cult shop. Holy candle. Hardware shop. Shovel? Crowbar? Chance of gaining funds. The hammer fucking sucked. I'm not gonna use the hammer again. Escape the village twice. Go. Sorry, just looking. I didn't have any money, so. Also, let's go check in with Kana. Nope, busy. Okay, let's go. Let's actually go check at the schoolyard. Ask, ask, ask. Minus one strength, plus one reason stamina. Okay, we're gonna let you go immediately because you're a hindrance. So now me and some schoolboy are out, uh, you know, being all masculine, killing monsters. Uh, village again. Kindly refuse, because I fucked up last time I did that. Okay, we have the dust of seeing. You love to see the dust of seeing? Help her. Luck check failure. Great, okay. We get experience from this. Let's do it. Let her sleep.
help the man. Dexterity trick failure. I just keep losing stats. It's getting annoying. Wish there was a way to unblink these without having to click on them and then exit out of them. That's one of the only things I don't like about the game's UI, to be honest. Result? Yeah, no, I don't have any spells. This is meaningless. Theme for Poyo X Potter. They go to the sweet shop in Hogsmeade, and Kirby's trying very hard not to eat anything, so the shopkeeper gives him a lollipop. Aww. Hope it's not one of those every flavored uh, types of lollipops. I've always thought that the that the every flavored beans thing was so weird, because why would somebody want to eat like gross stuff? <laughs> you know. Like I get, like I understand that in the in the context of the of that world, it's just kind of silly, and it's meant to be that way. But it's all, but like, just thinking back on it, it's like, what child wants to eat a candy with the chance that it tastes like puke? I don't feel like that would sell very well. Follow the weird man. Damn it. Just failing every check now. Every single check. Disgusting slurping sounds. Okay, so this shouldn't be too difficult, right? 72% hit chance. Only one stamina damage, so we're not even gonna... Oh, fine. What? Wait, what? Oh, it regained health! Oh, that's fucking crazy. Fucking vampire. Foreign muscle? Oh, no, no, it's... She didn't regain life. She hit me, I got this, and then I dealt less damage immediately. Oh, no, I'm fucked. Oh, I'm so fucked. Holy fuck, I am so fucked. This is so bad. This is so bad. I might just die in this first combat here. 15 damage. Costs 3 reason. 2012, they put movie stuff in the city museum. I went with my parents. We tried the beans and the puke one deadass tasted like olives. That is hilarious. Am I really gonna just punch this thing slowly? I'm getting so lucky right now. All right, wait, my punch is one damage. Oh, this is such bullshit, dude. This is such bullshit, man. What do you mean I missed? Fuck you, game. Uh, yeah, I'm just dead in this first combat, I believe. Chocolate Frog was good because it was chocolate with Pop Rocks in it. That's cool. I'm glad that it is not a literal frog. This is bullshit, dude. That was pathetically, disgustingly, fucking retarded nonsense. Unbelievable how outrageously difficult that was. Try again. Uh, yeah, I 
Eternal Web, Kafak Atarasu. Yet again. Load, confirm, continue. Bottle. The library notes! Oh shit! We'll do this one time. Grow teeth. <laughs> okay, now we're gonna sell these. I'm gonna go my wardrobe. You know what happened? I think my drip gave me bad luck, so I'm gonna have new drip this time. Uh, bath experience. Grow tea. <laughs> what a fucking stupid. What a stupid fucking thing, huh? Oh, there's noisy nails again. Let's not do rancid ramen. It wants us to discard items, and I don't want to discard any items yet. Household hell, evolving eels. We get Kana immediately if we do this one. Let's do this one. Always puncture Kana's eyeball. Every time, puncture her eyeball. Always stab her in the eyeball, period. No exception. Investigate the seaside. Well, first we need occult items. Defeat a vampire. Wow, this fucking sucks. Restock, please. Okay, this is all, this all gives me more confidence. Put that on. We have four money left. Let's go to this shop now. And we still have money for the hardware store. Unless I want to get an... Uh, you know, let's, get, let's try to get a knife, actually. Yep. Okay. We efficiently use all our money. Please fucking stop blinking. I'm gonna lose my mind. It was a free tour of the props and clothing and stuff. We all got to go inside Hagrid's hut and sit in, sit in his chair. It was so big, even my dad looked small in it. Ooh, that's cool. That's very neat, actually, unironically. Fuck you. Fondest memory. Now I have more money, I guess. That's... Stop! This is a crime scene! Focus on the officer. Reception check failure. What are you looking at? Scram or we'll lock you up for a night. Okay. Minus one reason. Yay. We still have the photo we took there. Somewhere in the house. I don't know where. Hmm? Cool. Sure you'll... Find it again at some point. Cold bath. Strength success. Ice cold water revitalizes you when you're ready for the investigation. Nice. Yeah, we did, uh, yeah. Fuck! Man, where was where was this thing the fucking first run we did? Check plaques and trophies. Luck check failure. How could she sip her soda so calmly, staring at this disgusting creature? First, let's go. Let's let's do this now. Ask to join. Ask to join. Ask to join. Luck. Knowledge down. You dumbass. Fuck you. Go away. It was funny because every movie Harry has like one shirt he just wears over and over. In the museum it showed the clothes and it was that ass just one shirt for each movie. Fucking hysterical. Well, that's funny. 
But I also, like, I don't know. That feels like such a mood of it's like, yeah, I'm going to wear one thing and just wash it overnight. Like, every day. <laughs> that feels just like the struggle of being a poor fuck. <laughs> Calm her down. Charisma check success. I gained some reason. Good, because I took some reason damage earlier. This eel even alive? Curse! Chance of raising doom. Great. Be wearing the same nine-year-old jacket daily. Honestly, dude, I have a, this raincoat I have been wearing since I was like nine years old. Because it was too big for me at the time, and then I hit 5'8", and I stopped, and so it never got- it never became too small. Also, my main shoes are like almost 10 years old too. Jesus! You have such tiny feet! Itty bitty! They're pretty, so I keep wearing, yep. Hey, if it works, it works. Hey, Charisma Check success. Got some experience. No! Stop the raising of the doom! It's 30% on the first investigation! You fucking... This game is so hard! This game is so fucking hard! It's bullshit! I'm gonna drink this, by the way. I might throw this or, uh, ditch it later. This guy here gives me better luck, though. Help her! Luck check failure. Thanks, okay. Neighbor's apartment! Bedroom! Puncture her eyeball! And they come out! Blech. Blech. Disgusting. They're so gross, they lag the game. Wait a minute, what? Shocked, you see countless tiny eels crawling out of your friend's eye in all directions. Will Kana even survive the blood loss? No, this has never happened before. We've never gotten a, a, a scene before where uh, Kana, like, doesn't get saved by this. Oh, thank Christ almighty. Okay. That was close. Wake up, dude. You've been sleeping for over three hours. Not so pretty anymore, huh? Couldn't exactly tell the doctor's the truth about what happened. I'm pretty sure I won't be winking with my left eye anytime soon, but thank you for saving my life. Holy shit, I was so worried that it was going to result in failure anyway. Library is disabled, don't care. No, I am I am never playing a spellcast. I rarely play spellcasters in this game. It seems so hard. I want dexterity. My knowledge also sucks, let's get a knowledge up. My god. Okay, let's go here. Here. Reason. Okay. Very nice. Not so pretty anymore. You know how hot female pirates are, you dumbass? <laughs> yeah. Oh, yeah, that's funny. Even though it's like an absolute fucking fiction, you know, in real life, it's still, it's still very fucking, you know... You can't see me doing the okay sign, but I'm doing the okay sign. Right, okay. Anybody out here? Yeah, there's a weird person out there. I don't care, though. Let's, uh... Get to the next mystery. Horrible history household hell. Reckoning bulletin. Rancid ramen. Do household hell again. Maybe we can buy a, um... IRL female pirates in history probably look like Florida man, but I don't care. I feel like female pirates probably were almost 
never happened. I feel like pirates would just, like, take them as sex slaves or something, because pirates are... Like, everybody thinks pirates are cool, but let's be real here. They're fucking horrific... In reality, they're horrific monsters that murdered and killed innocent people. <laughs> if we're gonna be completely realistic here. I would assume that they would just take women as, as slaves, is my assumption. I assume they'd be incredibly aware, but just remember that one story Dankula said. Uh, I don't think I remember that one. But I believe it. I believe it. Since, since you're uh, accounting something that we probably saw together at some point. So, Kano, okay, so uh, we have two money. You know what? I want, like, a, I want a flashlight. Nice flashlight. Fictional pirates are cool. IRL pirates, those Somali dudes who murder everyone. Yeah. Well, I mean, even Caribbean pirates in reality were, were like probably like that. It's just that they were, you know, like from the 1800s. They were they were a, a mixture of white, South American, and black, and all that. You know. So, uh, C signed twice, I think. What it turned out to happen is that we do investigate the seaside one time during the actual investigation. I watched a Horrible Histories episode as a kid, and I really and I remember pirates sounding really lame. Can't see me shrug, but I'm I am shrugging. Like I don't I don't know if they were lame necessarily. The dang thing with the female pirate fucked and killed. Lots of dudes that was constantly drunk, hence Florida man. Right. Right. That makes sense. Strength check success. The sun blizzard disappears as fast as it began. You leave the beach quickly. That was weird. <gasps> Enter! Okay, so this doesn't do anything. Horrible history is used to be good, but they went super woke. Child me would be sad. That's unfortunate. There's a history channel I remember watching earlier this year that it was like be it was very interesting and entertaining. And it but it wasn't like it wasn't like being woke about like a like a, it was this channel and I saw this video about Alexander Dumont. General Alexander Dumont, who was a black Frenchman during the, the, the era of Napoleon. And something I didn't know is that the French are so schizophrenic that they both had slavery, but did not all, but also had a bunch of like free blacks as well, like in the 1800s, while Britain and the United States were still enslaving. France was just being completely insane and they broke every convention you could think of. And Alexander Dumont was, was a black Frenchman who was one of Napoleon's generals. And it was very interesting, but it wasn't it, and it wasn't really all it wasn't really all like woke or anything. So. They legit did an episode on white people have no culture. What? <laughs> oh yeah, let, let's let's ignore like literally the thousands of years of European history. Okay. Yeah, no culture, okay? What? <laughs> wow. Okay. So here's the thing about this blood thing. The only way we can do this blood thing here is if we have a chalice. And we don't have a chalice. Um, I feel like if I submerge myself, I just instantly die. But I'm not sure. So we're gonna do it. Take a step into the pool of blood. Your crim The crimson liquid burns your skin through your clothes. Besides the boiling blood, something else rushes in your ear canals. The voices of countless scholars revealing forbidden secrets. Oh, well, that didn't do anything except make me take damage. That sucks. Horrible histories from ten years ago had entire episodes on white cultures. They debunk the current episodes. <laughs> yeah. I mean, I wonder what happened. Like, they must have, like, changed hands from owners or something, right? That would make sense. 
is that because that just that's such a long period of time it makes sense to me that they would like that someone would just forget and because of like a, a change in uh, hands of some kind Perception success, good. And here we go, Seaside! Yeah, probably, because I don't look at the current episodes. The bit I saw, I didn't really recognize the cast right. Canis, the Lunar Cat. Reason damage. Honestly, let's just hack and slash. We cut and we sliced and we cut and we sliced. But okay, so now that we have the uh, the flashlight, we, this uh, particular investigation is more interesting. Check out the table. Knowledge, success, experience. Very good, I like experience. Middle room, you see a man tied to a chair. You rushed in to help. You remove his gag, though the man starts shouting curses and ancient prophecies. Fall onto the floor. Your mind flows with unspeakable images as the man slowly stands up, leaning on the chair. Yeah. Oh, he's a do. He's a doomsayer. Okay. statuette. Knowledge? Well, it's in your inventory. Okay, cool. I like having higher stats. Kirby takes out his his bibble and starts the exorcism with Father John. Go for his weapon! Strength check success. You grab at the enemy man's weapon. You slam to the ground as you wrestle for it. Until you finally manage to tear it from his fingers. You find yourself with a pistol in your hand. And the thug nowhere to be seen. semi -aught. Oh boy. See, this is good, but it, if this is basically the same as the knife, but it's a strength weapon and it's faster, actually. And it will actually, no, it's not faster, it's a better chance to hit. Let's give it a try. Let's, let's give pistol whipping a try. Might as well. Drink the wrath of the Almighty! Poyo, 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 poyo! poyo. <laughs> uh. Search the room. Another item? Holy shit. We have so many items. We can definitely discard these for uh, the uh, ramen case. I'm actually glad I got this gun because... I think that it's very... I might be able to shoot at the giant eat monster. We'll see in a moment, though. Whether or not that's a thing. Minus two reason. Yay. Okay. Fuck off. I hate the fucking money man. You have no... Why can't I stab the money man to death? the fuck? Plus one strength, minus two maximum reason in slot C? What the fuck? <laughs> what? Uh, sure. More combat. Nine strength? Okay. Here we go. Make your way down. Explore some more. Oh, no! Oh, no! I forgot to read the thing! Shit!
Oh no. Oh no. Is it like 36 or something? I forget. Or is it different every time? I don't remember. Fuck! Oh, that's that 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 feels bad. That feels bad. CQC. Strength, why not? Pistol whip really, really hard. Oh man, that feels so bad. Holy shit. So stupid. Oh, and they disappeared from my inventory too. That sucks. Okay, I'm gonna put these away so that I can grab the bottles. Man, that sucks. Drink it. Okay. That fucking sucks! Man, I have a gun! Maybe I could have shot and killed the thing. God, that would have been so cool. I've never done that before. I fucking forgot about how the fucking thing worked. Rancid ramen time. Discard. Discard. Smelly meat. Ah, uh, my meat smelly. Curious statuette. Wow, okay, well. Wow. Well, nurse, schoolyard, hey. Hey, you. Hey, you. What do you do? Fuck you, go away. Not wanting to wait for an elevator, so I take the rarely used stairs. Twisted corpse. It's a ghost enemy. I don't like ghost enemies. They are annoying. Can I dodge at all? No. Failed to lose a random ally in hand, no. They only do one reason damage. It's not the worst thing ever. It's just annoying. Two years ago, a drunk salaryman fell down the stairs and broke his neck. Now his restless spirit is doomed to continually repeat the accident, breaking even more bones. I don't know if I needed to do that combat, but what's done is done. Call the police. I don't want to lose more reason after that. Oh. I don't want money, dude. Question. Can I still send in the smelly meat when it's in my fucking storage? I don't know. I guess we'll find out in a moment. Cult shop. Holy candle! Very important. Get lost. Destroy target creature and create two map tokens. You won't destroy my life's work? I don't know, watch me, bro. Seventy-five percent hit. Or at twelve. Sixteen. <clears throat> 
Bam. Do I want two guns? Is there any point? No, I don't want two guns. What am I talking about? Get experience. Follow the weird man. Mine is to doom. Yay. Okay. Very good. Investigate lab. God damn it. It does need to be in my inventory. Fucking annoying nonsense. Whatever. Whatever. What the fuck ever. Quick thinking. Ooh, we get dexterity. Here's more luck. Luck has been... I have, like, random luck... Luck ups that are, seem to be pretty good. That have been helping, I think. Do dexterity spring? Roads closed. More doom from the village mansion and forest. Okay. Bath. Reason regain. All right. So there's the beckoning bulletin and then the nails. Well, let's let's do. Yeah, let's do uh. Bolton. Yep. Pray. Perception failure. To your horror, you discover a seven, severed human hand behind the statue. Yay. Love it. Are you fucking shitting me? <laughs> oh my god. What a fucking annoyance. Christ. Okay. Forest note. Look at the note. Put the note away. Take the compass. Yay, stamina damage. Okay, finally. I am fighting stamina damage. 105% hit rating. Okay. 4, 8, 12, 16. Oh, it's only 5 more damage. Okay. We just attack four times. I pistol whipped her to death. Absolutely thrashed her. Or stamina damage. 105% hit rating. All right. Alright, 12, 16. Dead. Gotcha, bitch. Alright. Oh my god. Disgusting. I'm just killing. I am just killing, killing, killing right now. We're 
always such a kidder. I am a 24-year-old Yakuza taxi driver. What are you talking about? Everyone who dies in this game ends up on Grimm's desk, yeah. Hit the cheap one. Dexterity success. You were always such a kidder. Harvester reference. Oh! Oh! Wow, we missed that for a while. Bulb event. Oh, I lost stamina randomly. Okay, fine. I should probably go rest to get my... Take a ride. Luck check failure. Oh my god. Okay, I, I need to rest to get this. This is so bad. I have I have 85 doom right now. Oh my god. Unbelievable. Sometimes when I do stuff, my brain shuts out the game, but just pays attention to the commentary. Yeah, yeah, like, I also don't read a lot of it, because so much of it is a repeat from previous uh, things we've done. Enter the portal. You and the figure get close to the portal, ready to swap places. Where are you? Katana? Katana! Yes! Yes! Then the decaying knave, you find a keepsake from the ancient world as a humanoid skeleton wearing ruined armor. The weapon looks strangely familiar. Oh, yes! Oh, my God! Ooh! Oh! Nut! 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 Mega Nut! I see QC, though, is worthless now. <laughs> I'll carry this katana until, like, the next combat. Fuck off, game. Oh, my God. School nurse. Fucking spider bite. Fuck you. I'll put the gun away. For now. Are you actually... St what? Are you fucking... Uh I got bit by the same spider twice. In a row. Remember the note. Minus one all. Okay, well. Oh my god, 66% chance. Okay, maybe this was a bad idea. But how can the katana ever be a bad idea? It's nine damage, though. Holy moly. This is 13 damage. This is a 96% hit chance. This is nine. Dead. I killed the modem, everyone. I have saved you from bad internet. Uh, let's do art knowledge and dexterity. This art knowledge unlocks things for you to do. I don't have a lot of faith that we're going to be able to win this one, even though we're doing a bit better than usual. But hey, at least now we're going to do a new one. We're going to do... Oh, you know what I just realized? We have a katana? Samurai outfit. <laughs> All right, this is a brand new one. We have never done this one. Let's see what happens. Nightmare news of the noisy nails. The 
morbid killing spree continues as another body is found in the city's river. Oh, wasn't that just me, though, killing the monsters? Every victim shares one common trait. Their finger and toenails are missing. They've been pried off. Ew. Why nails? Could the killer have a hidden motive? Are they sending a message? You must hurry up before they claim another victim. God, that's... Oh, God. That, like, this is pixel art, but it's still very nauseating. I used to watch a lot of, like, uh... Of, like, uh... Podiatry videos. And, like, watching people have their toenails completely removed by a podiatrist, it's like... It desensitizes you to looking at it, but then when you think about it without with the context of, oh, they're not being, this isn't being done by a doctor, they aren't under an anesthetic of any kind, it's like, oh god, oh Jesus Christ almighty, holy fuck. With no leads, a trip to the police station could be useful. Your friend's cousin works there, and she could help you. Time is of the essence, so you decide to take a shortcut to the abandoned building site. Gather gossip at the current mystery. Schoolyard. Latest gossip. No gossip about the mystery. Oh well. Wait, we're at 98% doom. We've lost. It doesn't matter. Nothing, nothing matters, actually. None of this bullshit matters. Already fuck, I forgot it was Wednesday. How's it been today? It's been okay, we've only been losing, and we're about you're about to watch us lose our third our third run here because we're at 98% doom, even though we have the katana. Because this game is so fucking unbelievably ass blastingly difficult. Ooh! Experts are baffled by the sudden appearance of 20 stone statues. I can cast this for no uh I can free cast this. Nice. Now I have teeth. Ball. Okay. The fat ripperoni. Yeah, no kidding. Schoolyard. Gossip. Zero 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 didn't make these drawings. Then who did? It's so hard to get any sleep. Ask? Ask. Okay. And then we lose. God, what fucking nonsense. This game is such nonsense. We didn't even get to do the new fucking... If we get the new noisy nails thing again, we're gonna do it. Okay, time to randomize. Closing my eyes. Okay, what do we get? We have, like, peach and silver. Okay. We have, like, or, or orange and gray. Okay, time to go cold turkey again. I really want to fucking complete a cold turkey challenge. I don't know. God damn, it's so hard. Oh god. Oh god. Oh god. Oh god. Wait, no, I didn't mean to randomize. Oh. You're so deflated. God damn it. Okay, well, whatever. Look outside, nothing. Okay. Go here. Get this. Get, get this Yakuza outfit, sure. Who cares? And we didn't even get the new one! <laughs> Why? Oh my god. Worrying right up of a wordless ward. I forget what... I don't remember what that one is. Uh, sure, household hell. Why not? We don't have the dog shop!
Sure, strength weapon. That's gonna be really difficult to use because I'm cold turkey. First doll funny mask. Ritual mask. Plus one stamina or reason at the beginning of a combat encounter. I think ritual mask is objectively stronger. Kana is busy. Oh, great, and it's the library instead of the schoolyard. <laughs> Honestly, this is so bad. I want to just restart. This is so bad, I just want to restart. We'll keep the color scheme, though. God, what a fucking annoyance. Okay, you throw two. Extra damage. Alright. Load. Confirm. Okay. Oh, there was no item this time. Okay, oh well. Freakish fable of a frightening flood. Let's do the restless rumors of a regi residential recluse. That's also a new one we've never done. Let's try it. Restless rumors of a residential recluse. While you don't get much normalcy in your life these days, today was just supposed to be just that. You'd been planning to take today to de-stress before your next investigation. Instead, you awoke to find yourself trapped inside your own apartment. The walls have grown over the door and windows, leaving no exit. Looking through the people, you yell and call out to passing neighbors, but your cries fall on deaf ears. It's fucking Silent Hill 4! I had to reset internet, but I'd be back. Silent Hill 4 be like, yeah, wait, what, what? It's just suddenly Silent Hill 4. What? Who could have done this to you? More importantly, how are you going to get out of here? Oh no! Oh, it's a zero item area lock in! Oh god! What the fuck? I have no items and I have been locked inside! What? The windows are covered in a thick layer of drywall, leaving only shallow cavities. The front door isn't much better, but there must be some way out, right? I'm gonna click on all this stuff and I'm not finding anything, so... Main room. Waste another day. Sitting on the sofa, you find yourself repeatedly checking the time to get some grounding. When you go to eat, though, you realize the clock in the kitchen displays a different time, and your bedroom alarm clock is completely different from each of the others. They need a battery change, probably. You're sure there's some explanation. You shrug it off and get your food. You pretend you're not nauseous when the clock later shows negative numbers, jumbled words, and nothing at all. Great. Where is that whore Cynthia at? Man, if only. We'd have something to do. <laughs> Jesus Christ. Spend your time searching your apartment for a way out, but you're already getting exhausted. Front door. Wallpaper and paint have spread around the door edges. Door's edges. No matter how hard you try, the door refuses to budge. I'm gonna click on objects. Look through people. 
Gotta find the meat tunnel, Mr. Kuza. <laughs> Well, at least he can't get through either. Okay, well. Waste another day. Loud knocking wakes you up in the middle of the night. Open up, shouts the deep voice from behind the door. I know you're there. Get close to the door and ask, what's the matter? Dexterity failure. Okay. That's a normal one, actually. I'm going to lean forward, so hold on a moment here. I forgot to mute myself, didn't I? Oops. Oh well, doesn't matter. Is I hope this isn't one of those things where I need a bunch of items from other fucking things in order to... What the hell? There's a weird drawing stuck to your door. Oh, it has an X marked over here. Cool. Waste another day. Oh god, knowing my knowing my fuck it, fuck it. Knowing my luck, I'm not gonna Yes! Experience points. So the marking on the door. Kitchen. Your pantry's starting to run out of easy meals. You don't have the energy to cook. Ugh. Come on, man. Just cook. You still change clothes every day, but is there any point if you're not going outside? There was an X marking in in this room, so I, I'm wondering what I do. Guess waste another day. Should have stocked up on ramen. I might have. I might eat noodles. I'm done with this. Why would you bother changing clothes if you're stuck in your house? I mean, I guess this guy is just trying to maintain his normal routine. Me, personally, I would just walk around in my underwear. <laughs> like, fuck that. Like, what's the point? Nobody's gonna see me. I ain't going outside. Find an envelope lying on a pillow in your bedroom. Inside is cash and a note from someone who has been watching you. They wish you luck in your task and promise to meet you soon. How did this envelope end up in your bedroom? Weird. Money. Got a wizard money gag. Oh god. You wonder how things are changing out there without you around. If nothing else, you're at least safer in here than out there. Look through people. Can't see anywhere outside. Kitchen. Oh my god, okay. All my shit is getting molded. Door room. Okay, here we go. Just standing in here makes you lightheaded. The bed is too tempting. You shouldn't stay long. Check behind the desk. Something guides your hand. What is this? Not the toy. Purse removal? That's pretty cool. That's very rare. Check behind the wardrobe. You don't have the energy to keep searching. Okay, waste another day. Shadow Wizard Veggie Gang. They love spicy death ramen. Read the letters. Luck check failure. Minus two funds. Great. All right, I can't look through the peepholes. What were you doing again? Look behind the shelves. Something guides your hand. What is it? Check the note. I used to live here too. This was only this was the only place that was it, it that was 
E A F Ed Good. All I could do was stay in, eat, and sleep, and when the food ran out, just sleep. When someone eventually came for my corpse, I'd already made my way inside. You moved it. I can't tell you how happy being with you has made me. Please don't worry. I will keep you safe, I promise. What the fuck is happening? I can't tell you how happy being with you has made me. Please don't worry. I will keep you safe. What the fuck? So I'm like trapped in here with a ghost. You don't have much of an appetite. The apartment cradles you gently in your sleep every night, keeping you warm within her ribcage. What the fuck? Is, is this unbirthing vor? Like, what are you- what? What the fuck? What are you- what? Waste another day. Go to use the bathroom, you notice there's a clump of hair coming up the sink drain. You're certain that it's not yours. Pull it out. Luck check success. You tug the strand of the drain only to find a few coins tied to the end of the hair. Find a few coin, uh... You pocket the money and try to think about it. What the fuck do I- do I have to use the- the toy? Approach the wall. Uh-oh. As you get closer, you notice thin cracks in the wall above the bed. Something dark glistens. It's a wall vagina, I think. Something dark, glistening red pulsates inside. Yeah, it's a wall vagina. The cracks move like lips. Yeah, it's a wall vagina. And the apartment whispers to you. Just lay down. You hear wooden support beams creak as the walls flex, reaching toward you from all sides. And let me take care of you. Care of you. Sacrifice the toy or prepare for combat. I have literally no items. I cannot fight a wall vagina. <laughs> Sacrifice the toy. The wall opens even further deeper. No! A girl lies curled up inside of the apartment's womb. Just want you to be safe here. What did I do? Why won't you just stay? Roommate. But I sacrificed the toy! I thought I'd get to... The lesson is that women are scary. <laughs> Oh my god, I have to hit her 11 times? At 3 reason damage? This game is unbelievable! Okay, I have to dodge. There's like nothing else I can do but dodge or else she's gonna just kill me in 4 turns. I need to kill her in 11 turns. But she kills me in 4 turns. So like... I just have to hope I get lucky, I guess. Oh god. Cat, it's starting. Oh my god. So bad. Doubles all damage dealt this turn? That's not going to save me, though. Great. Okay. How many spells I can forget? No.
What an unreasonably difficult game. What an unreasonably difficult game. Holy moly. Okay. Okay, so I'm gonna randomize this again, close my eyes, and what's this? Wow, that's very green. You know what? Maybe we don't do this. Maybe we wait a little while or something. I don't know. No, I can't give up on this. What an unreasonably difficult game. Holy shit. But I can't, I can't give up. Cannot give up. Load. Confirm. Continue. Empty bottle. All right, let's go here. Boom. Boom. Go here. Get a new outfit. Get money. Get the money. Five funds. Lots of water. Well, there's this one. We haven't done this one yet. Done, uh, well, we, we've done it, but we haven't gotten all the endings. Let's try this one. Freakish fable of a frightening flood. A group of researchers from a university in Tokyo are researching a curious rock formation. Oh, right, we have to go to the village now. Oh, fuck. Fuck, oh well. I remember this one, yeah. Okay. We done we done gone damn went to a village. Let's go. Kaiba village. Kaiba oh no, excuse me. Kaibara village. The final stop. Bus suddenly stops, the driver opens the door. Ruckingly knows there's you're still far away from the village itself. However, before you can ask any questions, the bus's doors close. As the old bus drives away, you see the village in the distance, hoping it won't rain too much. You stop to look at the clouds. Suddenly, you hear a splashing sounds behind you. That's strange. You thought you were the only passenger on that bus. Wow, this man is sweaty. Bus sweat lord. 80% hit chance. Maybe when he dies, I get a knife. That'd be cool. This is two, three damage. I kicked him to death. You managed to defeat the mysterious assailant, but he flees to the woods before you can tear his mask off. Who was that? You enter the inn, hoping you will find the research team there. Every room is, is, is empty except one. The last one, you find a visibly stressed man, Matsuda-san, the expedition leader. Thank God you came. We've been attacked by the villagers who got separated. I'm worried for my colleagues. The things we've learned here, the knowledge, is too dangerous. We must escape this place as soon as possible. Matsuda-san gulps and looks out of the window before continuing. Last time I saw my team was at the school. We learned we used to, an empty classroom to keep our research notes and equipment. You should look there for clues. Remember, we must flee before the river level gets too high or else. Okay. Firstly, though, drink. Drink. Chug some water, heal these knife wounds. After Asana has told you all the research notebooks are in one of the classrooms of the closed school, you'll have to break in, right? Rock formation, Ibarra Village, school. Decline! Minus two reason. He suddenly grabs your hand. Oh, I insist. Helper, luck check success. Oh, that's funny. Da 
managed to find the empty classroom Matsuda-san was talking about. The research is gone, but hopefully the notes you found will help you locate them. Alright. The, pil the pillars are related to the cult of Bleh, a fertility goddess, of course. It's always a fertility goddess. People here refuse to help us with the work and forbid us from researching the village's archives. River's water level's rising. The village will soon be cut off from the outside world. Hurry up. Researchers are missing. Forest Village School. Well, the forest would be on the lowest level of ground, right? So let's go to the forest. Walking through the woods, you discover a sweater. It's torn apart and covered in blood. But where is the owner? Assume the worst. Wild beast must have killed this poor person. You, sat, you say a quick prayer before continuing. Or in the forest. My god, the trees are red. Block the sunlight. And you begin to feel gloomy. You manage to find one of the researchers. Kaori Yuto. Linguist. Yes. Village and school. That wine is terrific. So if I'm about to die of reason, I can drink this. Uh, let's go to the village again. If we haven't rescued that person. You try to lose the masked man who's been following you the whole morning. You eventually find yourself at a dead end looking for a way out of here, but just scraping, snapping behind. A branch snapping behind you. Cult delinquent. Yay! You know what? Drink this and throw it at you. Fuck you. I'm gonna also throw this at you. Fuck you. I'm gonna throw this at you as well. Fuck you. Alright. I'm gonna punch you one punch at a time. I punched him to death. You managed to find one of the researchers, Sakina Okada, geologist. Now, the school. Enter! Please, Katana. Fuck! Check the icy coast. Perception success. Taking out the ice, you find a hand of a nameless monarch, its fingers long and deformed. Feeling a strange urge, you kneel and kiss it. One of its rings falls to the ground. Resolve. Ancient ring. Plus one strength, plus five doom. Oh, God. That means I can remove it to lose doom. That's what that means. Something strangely charming about her. Hearing footsteps around you, you realize you aren't the only student here. I'm not a student! I'm 24! Girl is wearing a demon's mask, starts giggling as she gets closer. Minus four all. Really? Well, isn't that fucking uh, wonderful? <gasps> My god, okay. Punched her to death. Box cutter. Managed to find one of the researchers. Hiroki Shino Shinoe. Uh oh no, Shinohe. Theologist, Frank. This is a perception weapon. Better than no weapon. River's level is too high and the waves crash against the village's buildings. Run before the water devours you. How do I run away? Ian? Okay. Our only chance. Let's go! Es Escape! The villagers have disappeared. Where are they? Investigate the rock formation? I guess so. As you get closer to the bridge leading out of the village, Matsuda-san suddenly stops. I know this tune. Before you can react, he begins to undress and run into the darkness. Shocked, you begin to hear a faint moaning coming from the rock formation. 
What you see feels unreal. All the villagers are naked. They are dancing around the pillars and something slowly emerges from the river. Oh, right. It's like a monster. Tikuthra and, Kai and Kaibara's villagers. Oh, my God. Is it a fertility goddess because it has a vagina mouth with teeth? I don't know why I started another one of these when we had... But I know that we can't save during them. Okay, we're getting minus one damage and then plus two damage on each of our attacks. 30% hit chance. Wow. Wow! Am I really punching everything? I guess I'm punching everything. <sighs> Fucking nonsense. Okay. You know what, it's fine that we started another one because I'm about to die here. Because this game is unreasonably hard. Yep. The sun rises again, the river level lowers again, leaving the fields fertile. In nine months, a new generation of Kaibara villagers will be born. Your mind broken after the ritual, you will be kept alive, at least until the day of your, chi your child is born. Oh my god. Okay, well... Yet another, uh, entire stream of just failing in this game. Oops. Thank you all very much for joining me here tonight. Really appreciate you coming here to hang out with me. We will be back in two days, Friday, if you live in the United States. Uh, and we're gonna be back at it with Death and Taxes. Uh, so we, uh, started our second run in that game. So... You know, we're just gonna finish the... Hopefully finish the game this week. Uh, you know, Friday, Saturday. And if we finish it early, we can play something else like Stardew or this or my... Or maybe not. Maybe Minecraft. I don't know. We'll see. It, it depends on if we, you know, uh, finish, finish Death and Taxes early and there isn't more to do. There might be more to do even after a second run, though. So, you know, we'll see. We'll see. Um, if you happen to be new here and you enjoyed hanging out with us tonight, if you think I deserve a follow, I'd appreciate that quite a bit. We stream three times a week for approximately two hours. And this stream will be re-uploaded to YouTube tomorrow night where we'll join every single stream I have ever done. So if there are any you want to catch up on, you can find all of them there. Link is in the About section. And I guess next week when we do this game again, I guess I am going to, like... I might stop trying to do the challenge modes because they're just, they're, they're, they really are just that hard. Maybe I should just try and beat the game normal on like initiate difficulty a few times or something. I don't know. Yeah, like if that's how, what we have to do to like see the endings of the, of the investigations we haven't done yet, then I guess that's what we'll have to do in order to, um, oh, you know, actually unlock more things in it and stop seeing a death screen and the same investigations over and over and over and over. But okay, so, uh... Hope you all had a good time. It was nice and chill with, you know, albeit scream because horror game. Ooh, spooky. Other than that, uh, I should be getting out of here, so... Uh, thank you all very much for being here. I appreciate your support in every capacity. I hope you have a good afternoon, evening, morning, etc. I will see you all again soon with death and taxes. Ciao!